Hi, I'm John Patton with the Gainesville Sun and welcome to Citizens Field where tonight we are going to determine the District 5-4A champion. It's either going to be Lake Weir out of Ocala or it's going to be Gainesville High School. Both teams come in 8-1 and 4-0 and in district play. So both of them have been pretty flawless playing in the district. They both won by large margins and these obviously are the two best teams in district play. I'm just say it's an honor to be here tonight and supporting our team. And my name is El Diablo Travis. This is uh, Adam Super Kane. Yes. This is Cat. Uh, you know, they played us in a lot of man. We kind of thought they would. Our O-line did a good job of picking it up, and our receivers did a good job of getting open and making a catch. Uh, that's one reason why we're pretty good. You know? It's like almost a dream come true. So we didn't get greedy. And, I, mean, I mean, we got probably one of the fastest 13-year-olds in the world in Chris Thompson, and he just, if he blows by people, he's going to catch it, and it's automatic touchdown every time. So. They the ball real well. Uh, very well. We've got some receivers that make some plays, and the guy throws the ball extremely well. And first half, we disguised coverage. I thought pretty well. We had an interception for a touchdown, and, and, and played pretty good defense. Um, second half, we just we lost our discipline. We um... well, the regular season finale was a good one for Gainesville High School as they pick up a big, big district championship victory, 55-24 against visiting Lake Weir tonight at Citizens Field. The Hurricanes played tremendously. Ryan McGriff, 445 passing yards. After the first quarter, the guy was on. He was unbelievable. Had more than 200 passing yards in the third quarter alone. Ended three quarters with 410 through the air. Guy, he says, the fastest 13-year-old on the planet. Chris Thompson, um, the freshman, had more than 100 yards receiving. More than, had, had a couple touchdown catches. Spread the ball around. Six or seven different receivers caught the ball. Walter Holsley come, came on strong in the end. Had close to 100 yards after a late flourish. Gainesville High looked tremendous tonight. Bad thing, penalties, 185 yards worth of it, but Coach Ryan Smith says they're going to work on that. They've got two weeks to do so. I'm John Patton with the Gainesville Sun. Thanks for joining us here at Friday Night Lights.